I'm standing in Belgium in front of the brand new VDL factory and if we should trust VDL this is the most modern bus factory of Europe. Behind me we have the brand new factory for VDL and this is based here in Roselare in Belgium. Previously VDL was located in the Netherlands and they built and produced over there but now they moved their factory and they didn't do like many other European factories moving to other Eastern European countries or even all the way to Asia. No, they just moved on the other side of the Flemish border, not from the Netherlands, but over to Belgium. They're keeping the production in Europe. They're keeping it in the Western part of the Europe. This warms my heart to see. of April 2024, press, VDL workers and politicians were present to open the new factory of VDL in Roselare. Still, it's not correct to call this a bus factory. Join us on the inside of the new VDL facilities. The new VDL factory in Roselare is a 77,000 square meter facility that will produce a 100% green fleet of the next generation of Citea. The model has sold more than 900 vehicles and the buses have been rolling more than a half billion kilometers and it will be more buses. This new factory in Belgium can produce more than 800 Citeas every year. The Futura and the other diesel vehicles from VDL will still be produced in the old factory in Valkensvaart in the Netherlands. VDL is one of the oldest bus manufacturers of Europe and they started all the way back in 1881 with the Jonkere and then they started just to build some horse carriages. Then they started to build some coaches. So they started already in the late 1800s and now today they are showing us one of the most modern bus factories in Europe. And we are so lucky to come inside these facilities to see how they are producing the brand new buses. The next generation of CTA is not built from scratch here in Rosalare. Buses are coming in parts to the plants and they'll get assembled here. There is no paint shop or corrosion work here, just the montaging of the buses. The roof has about 2,000 sun cellar panels, so this factory is almost self-sufficient. So they are making a green line of buses with electrical buses with green electricity from the sun. After going through the very clean production line here in Rosalaria, the buses ends up here ready for inspection before they goes out to the customers. Today marks the opening of the brand new factory of VDL here in Rosalare. But this has an aftertaste as well. The same Monday in the same week that VDL is opening the factory here in Belgium, another big bus company here in the same country had to shut down because of bankruptcy. Van Hul couldn't make it anymore and this is a very sad part of the bus production in Europe. At the same time, it's very nice to see that VDL is making it and that they are building a brand new facility here in Belgium. Thank you so much for watching this video here today and if you like what you see, click down here, the button is called subscribe and then you will see all the future videos from us here in Bus Magazine. Until next time, have a great day, drive safely. Oh,